I lost my pops, my father, uh, 2020. Mm. And, and uh, you know, I'm I'm grieving. I'm going through it. Not not knowing, like, one year later, my wife is going to pass. Mm. And so it was, it was a different... I kind of, like, stopped grieving for my dad and started grieving for my wife more. Mm. And so um, it, it, it took me to a dark place in my life. Like, my, my family knows me. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll always be the, the stronger one. My kids never seen me in my weakest moment until my wife passed away. Mm. And, um, you know, I guided my kids. I, I told my kids, I said, hey, um, um, dad, dad is weak right now. So I need you guys to be strong. We be strong for each other. And so, you know, that's that's really why I'm still here. Uh, uh, you know, my kids, they're my sons, but they're, they're also my best friends, too. Like, we, we share a, a special bond. I, I share a special bond with them. And so it's not more like it was hard. I had to put my feelings aside because, mind you, I have five sons mm. that just lost their mother as well. Mm. And so... Um, I really didn't have time for myself to grieve during the daytime, but when it, when it's nighttime, that's actually my time to grieve. And so, you know, I, it, it's, it's, it's just some things like that that will break my heart. Like, we had one son that will always come in the morning and say good morning to, to me and his mom. Mm. One time he came, mm. oh, dad, where's mom? But mm. well, we just had a funeral, like, a couple of months ago. You know, and he's my son. You know, it's, it's hard for me to see that. Mm. Mm. Through my sons hurting like that, so I have my older, my older sons. I have two adult sons. You know, they'll call me out of nowhere from school, Dad, mm. and they're crying on the phone, Dad. I'm, I miss mom right now. You know, and these things. It's just hard things like that that we go through. But for me, like, man, they took me to like a dark, dark place, man. Mm. Like, mm. you start feeling depressed. You start. Having suicidal, you know, suicidal thoughts. And mind you, like I've been, I grew up in a ministry. Mm -hmm. I've helped people that was going through depression. Mm. I've helped people that was going through suicidal thoughts, not knowing that one day I'll, I'll be going through that. But it's hard when you lose a spouse. I tell everybody all the time. I said, man, the the, the day my wife took her last breath, mm. I witnessed it, and I told her I felt like a big part just died with her, like, mm. you know, and. and Tell you the truth, I was angry at God because I, I begged him to spare my wife's life. I'm like, Lord, if I've done anything good in my life, would, would you spare my wife's life? You know, and mm. man, when she passed away right there, it's just, it, I, I was just angry with God. You know, I, I was just a whole different person.